Alright Josh here and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon VGC 2019 Bots Battle Live series. Today is the last time we use this team. <laughs> I'm kind of relieved in a way. Um, yeah, it's, 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 not been the, it's not been the best. Um, I've ran into so many things that I just, I just wasn't prepared for. Wasn't prepared for them I'm afraid. This was prepared for the standard teams but I just don't think people are playing the standard teams anymore. The standard teams are not standard anymore I'm afraid. So... Yeah, well, I didn't even get to change music. Uh, next next week we'll swap to something different, hopefully better. And we're going to play a fairly standardish team. Um, Crobat's always a pain. I don't really like playing Crobat. But I, usually against this, I just lead Salomon's Finning. It seems to go mostly okay. I'm just going to Coco though. I got Salomon's Finning still. Um, I definitely want Xerneas, but who do I want to pair it with? Do I want Smeagol to set up, or do I want Lunala? Who do I want? Or do I want Katarnia? Katana's pretty good. Katana's not bad. If you get Tailwind up, though, and just... No, I, th I think I need Lunala. Should I bring Katana or should I bring Xerneas? No, I think I think I need to bring Xerneas. Like, Katana's a little bit threatened. Let's go with that. Oh dear. Right, get my brain back into it. I have recorded all this week's episodes in one sitting. I am fatigued, especially after the last episode. We got a, a right deck in last time. I over predicted so much. Oh, we got caught off guard in the last game, really. But okay, let's let's new mindset, fresh mind. Let's go. We can do it. We can end on a high. Let's end with three wins. I need to think. Not. I don't need to go for like reads. I just need to play safe. Coco Crobat. This is an ideal. I'm not gonna lie, this is not ideal. Although... It's not ideal, but... You can't... Like, I'm, I'm kind of expecting, like... Are you gonna Tailwind or you ta taunt my Salmons? Because I could Tailwind and Icy Wind, but the worst case scenario there is if Coco goes... Are you Rayquaza? Right yeah, so you're gonna have thunder. Like, I think I have to hyper voice. I can't risk tailwind in. If I hyper voice in icy wind, oh, I don't like this. I already don't like this lead. This lead's a bit of a problem. Maybe I should have. Even if I, if I had smeagol something, it wouldn't have been ideal either. Crobat's a real pain. I need to make a team one day that Crobat is not a pain for. Because he is a pain for every single team I make, I swear. Then again, every team, every single team I make has got Xerneas on it, so that's why it's, that's why it's a pain. Never mind. Okay, we're... I'm probably... Ugh. It does taunt. Okay, so I'm, now I'm glad I didn't go Tailwind. That's why I didn't go Tailwind. But you're going to Z me. Yeah, that's going into Finny, and I'm going to be dead. If this is off Thunder, I, I don't think I can live it. I've got a lot of bulk, but still, I, it's, this is so strong. And it's 100% it's going to be off Thunder. Like, if, you, if you've got Kyogre, you should be basing this off Thunder, really. That was a super safe play for my opponent, which is kind of wrong. Yep. Straight into the Finny. Bye-bye, Finny. Rip. Oh, I lived! Let's go! I did not expect to live that. Maybe it's not off Thunder. Maybe it's off Thunderbolt. Okay, this is, this is not a bad turn, then. This is actually quite a good turn. Surprisingly. Oh, go on, put Crowbat in range for another Hyper Voice. Let's get rid of Crowbat. Crowbat's such a... That's in range for another Hyper Voice. Okay, this is not bad. Um, this isn't too bad. We're going to get rid of Crowbat. That's actually really nice. It means you can't Tailwind. Um, do I want to switch? Uh, Pokemon to Xerneas. No, I'm not going to switch. I'm not going to switch. I'm going to... I'm going to hit Icy Wind again. Okay, that was great. That was a good turn. Well, well done, Finny. As 
don't know if that was, if that was a thunder, it was probably a roll. I have got a lot of special bulk though on my finney, it's literally like, I'm like near enough max, max HP and, and um, the rest is, I've got a bit of defence but it's mostly in special defence. There was some sort of benchmark I tried to hit but I really can't remember what it is. <laughs> okay, that wasn't a bad turn. And Hyper Voice actually did a lot to Coco, so we're going to KO Crobat. You can't really switch Crobat, oh you do switch Crobat, that's interesting. I mean, I don't mind doing damage to Kyogre. Oh, you're gonna thunder, that's why. I think you thunder. This isn't too bad though, because then I get Xerneas in. Even if I lose, lost both Pokemon somehow here, I can get Xerneas in and set up. Unless you Volt Switch. I think Volt Switch would be quite smart actually. Yeah, Volt Switch. That'd be quite a lot. And you bring in... Oh, but you, you bring in Crobat again. I get the Icy Wind off. So you can't bring in Crobat. This isn't too bad. Hmm. We're not, we're not too bad here, guys, actually. Because Crobat, Crobat comes back in, it dies. Well, it gets Icy Winded again. If Rayquaza comes back in, it takes a lot of damage. It is Crobat again. Okay. Yeah, this is quite good. Icy Wind Spam is so good. I'm telling you, it's super good. Super good. I mean, I need to KO Crobat. I need, I need to get rid of that thing. I'm, I'll probably lose Salamence for it, but it's fine. I could Moonblast Kyogre and try to get a special defense drop. A <laughs> special attack drop, sorry. Special defense drop. Special attack drop. I knew what I meant. Crobat does switch out again. I should have Icy Winded again. Ah! Are we going to kill the Coco with a Hype Voice though? I think we probably do. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. Unless Kyogre's going for Thunder. Okay, we get rid of Coco. That's actually quite a big threat out of the way. But I've not got rid of Crobat yet. That's what I really want to get rid of. And Kyogre's taking a lot of damage, which is super nice as well. Ice Beam. Yeah, that's fine. Obviously, I'll die to that. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Do you bring in Xerneas and set up? Yeah, I'm gonna bring in Xerneas. I'm gonna bring in Xerneas. Right, I bring in Xerneas. Crawlbats back out. Crobat's back out. I think Crobat tailwinds and doesn't taunt. I really think you protect Kyogre and tailwind. Or you origin pulls tailwind. I don't think you taunt Xerneas here. I really don't think you do. So I'm going to do a monster. I think you tailwind. And if I icy wind, at least you can't water spout me. I don't think you taunt. I, th I really think you tailwind. I'm going to go for those reeds again. I shouldn't do this. <laughs> Did I not learn my lesson? I, I just don't... I think you Tailwind. I don't think you... Because you've probably got Rayquaza in the back. And you've got to expect me to be scared of Taunt. Which I kind of am in a way, but... I, I don't... I think you Tailwind. I really think you Tailwind. It's like a 50-50-ish. Do you Tailwind or Taunt? Tailwind. Got it. Got you. I got you! Okay, that's great. Geomancy... That was obviously risky. That was 100% risky, but it was worth it. It was worth the risk. If it's Rayquaza in the back, I, I think I just win now. <clears throat> Unless Icy Wind misses Crobat. That is the only downside to this play. <sighs> My heart, seriously, as soon as I saw the opposing, I was like, no. Oh, thank God. Okay. Okay. Oh. Mi corazón, eh? Mi corazón. Um, okay, Ray is going to be the last for sure. Ah, shock horror is Ray Quaza. So, do we want to... 
What do I want to do? I think I just protect Xerneas and Icy Wind. Because if it's Choice Band Ray. It depends if it's Focus Slash or Choice Band. Oh, if it's. No, I think I think we're fine. I think I can Icy Wind. It's fine. <clears throat> if Finny goes down, it's kind of okay. The worst case if you, is if you Sword Stance. But if you Sword Stance and I get the Icy Wind off, I should be faster. Please don't tell me I've thrown this at the last minute. You might go for Finny. Like Extreme Speed Finny. Like, Xerneas protecting is quite obvious. <clears throat> yeah, you do do that. That was smart. It's life orb. That's kind of bad. That's bad. Do I live a life orb dragon center at this range? Oh, I actually don't know. Damn it! And I have to dazzle. <clears throat> then what do I do? Should I take out the Ray Quaza? Yeah, I'm gonna see the Ray Quaza. I don't think Moon Guys by itself will get it. And if if Zerny survives, it'll get redirected. This is. It wasn't over! Why would you do that? Well, I mean, I'll take it, but it wasn't over. It was not over. Like, I, th I genuinely think Dragon Ascent could have got me from there, you know. Unless... Unless they were, like, adamant. And not... Like a, like a slower... A slower Rayquaza. But I'm a slow Xenia, so... How do you know? That was that was by no means over. I really don't think that was over at all. Like if they killed Barry Quaza there, say, and I got the same move off. Yeah, then I reckon uh, I, I do reckon Lunala could have beaten Kyogre by its one on one. I thought maybe not. I don't know. Like Origin Pulse, <laughs> Origin Pulse is nothing to uh, scour right, is it? It's a strong strong move. Very yeah, interesting. The forfeit. I don't know. I really don't think that was over. I really wish I knew how. Uh, I wish, I wish that played out. I guess it depends on a few things. Anyway, let's jump back into game two. Okay, we found some gin. We found gin with a, oh, with a really interesting team. I really like this team. That's super cool. I feel that that is going to be a um, special ground on for some reason. Also, I'm a little bit scared of Suicune. Yes, I'm very scared of Suicune actually. Raw is not fun. I'm tempted to go Xerneas Finny because I could taunt the Suicune. Um, I kind of want Salmons as well. Although, actually, wait, no, no, no. I mean, Smeagol's really good here, isn't it? I can just, just rage. I can just follow me everything. Actually, yeah, let's go that. Let's go. Let's go this. Um, I think I want Salmons. Katana's, Katana's not bad. Katana is not bad here. Although Lunala's good as well. No, I think Lunala's better. Um, is it? I mean, I can pretty much live in. Yeah, I'll go Lunala. Okay, Jin. I don't mind a bit of Jin. Jin's quite, quite a... I mean, he's pretty strong, but he's quite nice. Which is right. It, one funny thing about Spain, right? Uh, like spirit, like in the UK, like you have like spirit measures. Like if you go to like a bar and get the gin and tonic, for example, you know they measure out the gin. In Spain, they literally just go start like pouring and say, "Tell me when you want to stop." It's, it's actually mental. It is actually mental. Oh, it would be just okay. It's Coco Sukun. So this is probably going to be a. I mean, it's either a tailwind. 
I mean, I'm not too bothered about Raw because Raw goes last and I can kill. If I set up, I can kill the Suicune, like, with whatever I have in the back, like Lunala, for example. I could just. I'm gonna go for the Geomancy and I'm just gonna follow me. The worst case here is if. Wait, this could go wrong if. Co Coco taunts and Suicune tailwinds. Would you do that? Would you do that? I might actually just. I might just get rid of the Coco. I might just fake out and Moonblast the Coco. I feel like Suicune tailwinds. Or Roars. Tailwind, I think. I think he Tailwind. Like, Taunt Tailwind. This should get it. Yeah, it does get it. I think this is going to be Tailwind. Yeah, okay. Right, I called that right. That's nice. Yeah, because, like, if you Taunt Tailwind, then then you can Roar next time quite safely, because Suicune... Do oh, here we go! Here we go! Because Suicune does live, like, a plus two boom blast if you EV, right? Use Suicune on the okay, Groudon comes in. That's kind of okay. Ish. It's okay ish. Uh do I wanna switch Simon's here? I don't really want to swap Simon's in because I'm gonna get you're gonna icy wind probably. You're not gonna be scolding, are you? Um Take Christmas blades. Do I want to set up? Do I? Do I want to set up? Or should I save these two? Nah. Nah. Well, uh. Okay, let's just follow me. I think you just maybe maybe you don't icy wind and Precipice blades because you might be scared of white guard. Okay, press piece, that's fine. He's made going to go to the side, so he's going to take about... Looks like it's three. Is that... Th yeah, it's definitely a three KO on Zonis. Oh, you do Icy Wind. Smeagol, I kind of actually want you to go down there. Okay. You see, I can't switch... This is the problem, I can't safely switch Simon's into an Icy Wind, can I? Eesh. If I'd gone down there, I could have brought Lunala in. So now I'm scared of Raw. Now I'm scared of Raw. I'm just going to dazzle, I think. I'll proc the berry if I... I don't want to save Smeagol. Smeagol's not doing anything. I mean, if Pres well, well, my evasion's up, so if Precipice Blades misses Smeagol and the Raw goes into Smeagol, it's actually not too bad. Okay, so I, I will still follow me just in case that happens. And then I can bring in Salmon's Egg and I can Wide Guard, which is actually super nice. Okay, I think we still might be okay with this. There's only to be faster than Groudon at least. I think. Actually, maybe not. Smiggle, back case, okay, Smiggle avoids. See, that's really, that's, that's what I was playing for. Okay, and I do survive. Snarled. I see what he snarled. Does he not have roll? He must not have roll. I don't think he'll have roll. Um. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna bring in the north. Is this the last turn of Tailwind? I think it is, isn't it? So if I protect Xerneas and Wide Guard. That pretty much covers everything. Worst case scenario, I get a free like you raw, and I get a free switch into into salmons. Yes, one turn of salmon. Okay, so if I protect, that stops my opponent going for a single target move, and if I wide guard, that stops snarl and icy wind and precipice blades. So if you raw, in the worst case, yeah, yeah, I think I think this is fine. I think that makes sense. Six six six. No, no, evil. Okay. Oops, it's gone windy. Suddenly windy. Let's see. Okay. 
And raw? Raw wouldn't honestly be the worst thing. I'm not. I, I'm. I wouldn't be too bothered about raw to be honest. Snarl. Okay, perfect. That's a that's a great turn for us. Um. Okay, so I'm going to Moonblast the Sukun. That should 100% get it, really. From there, yeah. If we Moonblast, I can psych up as well. I could see the ground on, but I'll, I'm going to psych up instead. We'll put us in good footing for whatever's at the back. I mean, that Groudon is in the Z move range. Maybe I should have just KO'd it. It's fine, though. That did. Oh, I got snarled. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, no. That's so bad. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, fuck. That was silly. That was super silly. Are you gonna snap? Oh, he's telling him, didn't he? Oh, God, no, that was silly, guys. That was super silly. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, I just threw Oh, I just threw God, that's not that. That was so stupid from me. I should have just seed the ground on. I still should have seed the ground on. I mean, fire punch small. I mean, I can protect at least. Actually, I'm not going to protect because I'm going to try and seed the ground on. I literally need to get rid of it. Into Lunala, I think. Yeah. Can I live? Oh, I threw this. I threw this so badly. Oh, no. Well, I mean... Protect. Tailwind. Does that do anything for me? Yeah, I suppose it does. Because you icy wind here. Oh no, I completely. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do that. I I forgot about that flipping special defense, special attack drop. That's super unfortunate. I should I should have. Either doubled the Suicune or doubled the or just got rid of the Groudon. I wouldn't have taken the damage then. An Icy Wind. Yeah. See, because I get this Tailwind off, I'll be faster than the Suicune. That's what I needed. It's going to do a lot, this though. Actually, not that bad. <sighs> okay. Right now, I just I'd have to dazzle Hyper Voice. I have to dazzle Hyper Voice, and we hope Hyper Voice takes out. It's not going to take out Groudon. Should do a lot though. Dazzle will pick up Suicune, Chip Groudon, and Hyper Voice. Single target Hyper Voice and Groudon. Should do a decent amount. And then who's your last Rayquaza? It's going to it's going to come down really close. You can probably extreme speed me to death, which is not ideal. Okay, bye bye Suicune. Oh, this is not going to get crowd on Hyper Voice, sadly. You probably fire point Xerneas, to be honest. That's what I would do. <sighs> that was a lot of damage, though, wasn't it? That was a lot of damage. Okay. Try me Rayquaza. Then. I have to Hyper Voice. And then Double Edge, I guess. Hope I can take two extreme. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I saw. So I, I. I mean, you can. You can dragon ascend me here. You dragon ascend. You dragon ascend and then extreme speed. Yeah, I lose. I can't, I can't beat this on The the red cause of. Oh, I, I should have. I wish I KO'd the ground on earlier, but I, then I would have given Ray Quaza the switch in. I don't know which is worse. Although I would have had a full. 
I suppose then I could swap. Mm, I don't know. I, it's, this was, yeah. I felt alright about this one, but it, it kind of went south a little bit. I'm going to see a dragon set, obviously. That does a lot. I mean, if. Dragon set? If I can live. I'm, I'm minus defense nature, though. If I can live and you, you choice ban, then I guess I'll win, but. Suicune was a pain, wasn't it? What a pain. It's a really bulky Pokemon. <laughs> maybe I need Finny. Maybe Finny could have done something there. Like if I had Heal Pulse and Taunt. I feel like I'm just bringing the wrong Pokemon at the moment. I feel like all the time, oh, every time I play with this team, I've just been bringing the wrong. Like I've not had what I needed. I don't know. Maybe this team's just. I. I. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe this team's just not that good. Or, but I'm not that good. <laughs> we'll go on that, we'll have the eighth foundation. All right, but we've got one more to play. Let's try and win one. I, I'm honestly looking forward to using the new team now. This team has so many problems. It's like, yeah, it's just, it's just really, I don't know. It, it, I've just not been, I've just not played anything I built it to be. And everyone's kind of spread out from those standard teams now. From what I can see on the battle spot ladder, anyway, and on showdown, really, to be honest, um, people just spread their wings, which is a good thing, 100%. Um, but it's certainly harder to. I think you've just got to build a team that you think solid, and just go from there, rather than build it to beat specific things. Um, because you can't build a team that beats everything. It's as simple as that. Um, but yeah, let's jump into game three. Okay, we do find an opponent with like a mid 1500s rating with Kyogre, Eveltal, Katarina. And. Mm, I'm a bit. Did, do you reckon this is Trick Room? I'm gonna go Smeagol. Smeagol Xerneas, I think, is fine. Yeah, I think that's not too good. I uh, definitely want Lunala. And I, I want Salamence as well, actually. What do I want my katana? My katana's pretty good. My opponent knows exactly what to do. Do I want Lunala? Lunala's not that good. Katana's good though. So Salmon's. Let's go that. Okay, we're actually bringing Katana. Let's see how this goes. Come on, we've got to win one. <laughs> well, I know we won the first one, but we've got to we've got to end on a high. This team has been very 50-50, up and down. Um, oh, I, I've definitely made some dodgy plays. That last game. I don't know about last game. At some point, I felt like we were in a good position, but Suicune was just a. It was just annoying, wasn't it? Just snarl, icy wind, and like I didn't have a. I couldn't safely switch into it. That was that was an issue. Like I just couldn't safely switch in. Okay, Velt on the other go. Mm. I mean, I could fake out. What I'm worried about is that being trick room near here. I go. Be trick room? Nah, I don't think so. I will just geomancy it and um, I can follow me. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, I, I, I imagine sludge bomb snarl, but then I can bring in katana. Okay, Nihilga protects us. That's super okay. Yep, snarl. Now I can boom blast and follow me, and I get a free switch into Katana, and then that threatens the Nihilego, and then we should be good to go. So if I moon blast Develtal, should get it unless it's AV and super bulky, and then that'll be kind of annoying. But I can just get it with the dazzle next tip, next turn anyway. So it's not the end of the world anyway. I think Katana can run over this team to be honest. I really think he can. Give me the speed. Okay. This, this is still okay. Moonblast you. And uh, just follow me again. I'm probably going to take another Snarl. Like, I, if it's AV of Eltal, it probably, it might be able to live. It should be able to live this, really. A, a neg one. It, if, if it's AV, it definitely will. If it's Z, then it's probably not likely to. 
Okay. What do you mean Cinderol? I don't really mind that too much. Do you need War Incineral? Clay Smug. Okay, Incineral's gonna take a decent chunk from this. Should do over half. Can I put it in berry range? That's kind of annoying. That's kind of annoying! Never mind. Bringing Katana here. Like, that threatens Nihilego, right? So you might protect Nihilego, and I could get a beast boost if I double Incineroar. Like, if you put like. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna Dazzle and Sacred Sword. I think you protect. I think you probably protect Nihilego. Why did you go fake out? Interesting. That's kind of still okay though. I'm not going to die to a sludge bomb. And even if you clear smog. It did have I can't believe he had trick room. Like, what the hell? I, I, oh. He has flipping trick room. Unbelievable. I, I genuinely can't believe he has trick room. I've not seen Ugh. Help! Help me! <laughs> he has trick room. Okay, we switch Katana to silence. Oh no, I can't believe he had trick room. That's crazy. That is crazy, crazy, crazy. I mean, if you clear smoke me, that's kind of fine. I can't, I cannot believe he had trick room. That's so weird. I mean,. It kind of works. Oh dear. Ah, uh, my wife's like, I'm coming home. I'm nowhere near ready for it. I'm not finished this game. I can't even type recording properly. Okay, that's into Zern. Ouch. Gonna poison me a bit. Oh no, it doesn't shock, shock horror. But I've just given you a free switch into, into the... Trick room semi west. Oh, yeah. See, usually these Nihilegos are clear smog, sludge bomb, power gem, role play, but obviously not. Obviously not. It's, I don't think he has clear smog then. He must have clear smog. You can just sludge bomb and ice beam me. I, I lose. I, I literally I can't sell out the trick room, it's impossible. Actually, impossible, I think. Um, yeah, I go down to another sludge bomb. I mean, I could. Mm. I guess I could switch in Katana, but if you water spout, it's, it's bad news for me. I try and double edge the Kyogre. Mm. Yeah, that got me good. I, I mean, I considered it, but I just, I did, it's just super, it's just super uncommon. Uh, well, maybe it's maybe it's common now. I don't, I, I genuinely don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's picked up in. You usually have role play clears. Well, it's either like oh, you two what's about? Yeah. Then power gem, and then you get another base boost, and it's Rocky MC. <laughs> this is over. This is super over. Interesting not having Clear Smog on Nihilego. I think Clear Smog is kind of... I, I don't know. I guess Trick Room is good in this scenario. But I, uh, oh man, I, I, mean, I wish I don't... Yeah, it's, it's like... Best of one, isn't it? You never know. You never know. I don't think you can ever get like too like down about not expecting something like that. Like, I thought about it, but I wasn't really expecting it because it's uncommon. Because, I mean, there's hundreds of Pokemon. And there's hundreds of different things they could be running, so it, it's like it's just one of those things. You can you can, can't always get it right. Anyway, this is 100% over. I'm gonna forfeit. My missus should be home any minute now. And yep, that's like 
Uh, this team's been. I, I'm honestly looking forward to using something else. It's, it's not been. It's not been too great. It was way better in practice than it has been um, in on the channel, 100%. Um, but I was playing a lot of like the, there's like Brown on Xerneas teams with Salmons, kind of that sort of thing, and I was playing a lot of X-Ray. And we've literally not played that at all. Maybe like one or two games against that sort of thing. Um, so in practice against those, it was great. But against um, all the stuff we've faced, some new interesting teams for sure. Um, it's just not been as good. So maybe next time we'll use something. Well, I mean, I suppose this Lunala's in his team is a bit interesting, a bit different. Um, but anyway, thank you very much for watching this episode. Take it easy, guys, and I'll see you all in a bit.